Yeah. Be more like a nook. She's positive. Not in like the sexually transmitted disease way, but positivity. Or COVID. Yeah, or COVID. No COVID positivity either. As you can see from the glare behind me, it is actually the first sunny day we've had in Scotland in probably about, I don't know, a month? So everybody has uh, kind of taken to getting outside and we're hiking the coastal path right now. So you can see St. Andrews is back there and we're doing a little social distance hiking, keeping three feet apart from one another. And what does it smell like again? Coconut. Cool. They make gin of it. They make gin of it? Yeah. Wow, she's right. These things do smell like coconut. Hmm. Who knew? This is a pretty fun hike. I have not been to this part of St. Andrews before. I think I've stopped right at the trailhead, but very scenic. Last summer. So this is how you do a social distance photo. You need to lean to the right. I know. Get the center. Here, I can't see myself. Here, uh, there we go. We must keep there. A little teapot. <laughs> Careful. That happened to me once and I had a sledgehammer in my backpack. I once had it with wine and the wine fell out of my backpack. Oh no, that's a party foul. I love sunny days. This world is just beautiful and colorful and happy. How happy? Uh, I clap my hands. Clap my hands. You're happy and you know it is what you're trying to say? Everybody is just in a good mood with the sun today. Scotland is so cloudy most months that uh, people really drop what they're doing to get outside and enjoy the sun and you can see that today. Well, I don't know what happened now, but we ended up in this huge green open set thing. This is a picnic spot if I ever seen one. It figures we're walking around this coastal path and up ahead it looks like we're going towards another golf course. But I guess that's St. Andrews for you. Still walking along the trail, no idea how long this thing is, or how many more minutes we'll be doing it, but it's it's a fun change. Beat staring at four walls in the apartment. Well, this seems like a good time to talk about it. I hope that while you're watching this, everyone watching this is doing healthy, that your family and friends are all healthy. I hope that no one you know has the coronavirus. I also hope that you know, if you have family and friends who are displaced from this, I hope that this whole thing uh, comes to an end soon and everybody gets back to economic comfort, which they had pre-coronavirus. Hopefully, if you're renting, your landlord's cool and understanding. Dare I even say this? It's getting too warm for the sweatshirt. That is super uncharacteristic of Scotland this time of year. Oh, Scotland, I love you. 20 minutes ago, I just took this off, and now I have to put it back on.
steep. We're just relaxing before we start to turn around and head back down the trail, back to St. Andrews. But overall, great day, nice to get out, get your mind off all of the crazy news feeds about COVID and all the bad things about the economic impacts. How is your coronavirus lockdown experience going? It's going pretty well. Yeah. This is, this is the life. Drinking <laughs> beer, having crisps in the sun. You are handling it better than others. What about you? How's your coronavirus experience going? I do miss coffee. I miss coffee with this one. <laughs> I'm baking bread for God's sake. <laughs> Bread. And she bought a birdhouse. So I have been to a lot of interesting places in St. Andrews, but I have not yet been to the coastal trail till today. I give it uh, two thumbs up. The other one's holding the camera, but very, very cool to see. I don't know why I haven't done this before. Probably because of the weather. That's why. But today we were able to get out and see it. <laughs> 